Welcome to Barbecue Food For You, the Backyard Barbecue Show. I'm Jason King. Today I'm going to be showing everyone a great way to stay cool in the hot summer heat. This is the Honeywell Portable Evaporative Air Cooler. Before getting started, let's answer a few questions on what an evaporative air cooler is and how they work. First question has to be, how do they work? Honeywell's outdoor air coolers use cold water and or ice to blow cool air into the space. Water is drawn from the tank through the filter and out the fan to cool the air, cooling the temperature of the space approximately 10 to 15 degrees cooler. This model has a continuous water supply. All you need is to hook up a garden hose. There's a top loading ice compartment. That's optional if you want to use the ice. It's also great for keeping the bugs away just with the fan. Energy use is very low, almost equivalent to a 150 watt light bulb, so barely takes any power. Yes, they are made to resist the outdoor conditions with proper wiring, switches, and all the parts made to stay outside in case it rains. An air cooler can be used for all different types of applications around your house or business. The main goal is to stay comfortable and spend more time outside. For me, it's cooking barbecue, having family and friends over. This would be perfect. Anyone that has a pool, got to sit outside, watch the kids in those hot summer days, turn this on. Also great for seniors and kids. Got to watch the temperatures and stay cool as well. Inside the box, you'll find a user manual along with a safety and maintenance guide. The only piece to hook up is this little adapter if you want to run a garden hose to it. Nice heavy duty breaker built right into the plug. At the top of the unit you have three switches. Your swing on and off that will control the left and right. You have three different speeds and your cool. This can also be used as a great fan. When you turn this on it kicks the water on. But if you want to just use it as a fan you can leave that off. Here's the water fill door. Really not going to be using this. Maybe put some ice in here, but I'm going to have the direct hose hook up for it. On the front of the unit, you have a water gauge, minimum, maximum. These two switches control the air movement up and down. On the left side, this is your garden hose attachment. Then I'll put the adapter on, and here's a quick peek at the back. Here's a quick peek at the bottom. You got nice heavy duty casters. The two at the back have locks on them. So once you get it into place, you can lock it down. The wind won't blow it anywhere. And this is your water drain plug. When you're putting the water hose adapter on, take your time, make sure you got the threads right, hand tighten it, and then just half a turn with a wrench. There are plastic threads in here. You don't want to put it on too tight and strip them. Just turned on the water. Not sure if you can hear it, but the gauge is slowly going up. If you do have high water pressure where you live, just gently, barely turn the tap on and there's a valve in here that will open and close as water is needed. So you won't have to worry about any type of overflowing or it running dry. Once the water fills up, I'm going to plug this shotgun mic into the camera. This picks up a lot of ambient noises. We'll see how loud the fan is and how everything runs. Here to go. I'm going to switch the speed on to one and then turn the cool on. Hopefully we can see the water going over the media filter. So there's number one. I gotta say already, this is nice just as a fan. I'm gonna switch it on to cool, which is gonna turn the pump on, see what happens. So, pump silent, perfect. Now you can already see the water coming down. So, I guess just give this a couple minutes so it's fully saturated. To get even cooler air, add ice to the ice holder. When the ice melts, it's going to go down the filled tube and into the water reservoir, making it even cooler. I must say, standing in front of this, it feels good. Nice, cool air. Ah. Now it's time for the real test. Got the outdoor air cooler set up on the deck, barbecue smoking away on a gorgeous day. It's nice and cool. I'm about 10 feet away. It's cooling down this whole area. Great addition to any deck. If you're looking to purchase one of these units, check out Home Depot, Lowe's, Amazon, or Canadian Tire. And for more information, go to outdooraircoolers.ca. Thanks for checking this out. Stay cool in the hot summer heat.